The main treatment these days for HIV, many people use drugs that are in combination, such as two or three drugs in one pill, which makes it much easier to take. The, the main treatment we use nowadays in Thailand and many countries is a combination of tenofovir with 3TC or FTC and then efavirenz. So these are three drugs uh, used together and you could call the three-in-one pill. Uh, there's a company that makes it and it's called a tripla or there are generic drugs. Now tenofovir is generally very well tolerated. It's no longer like the old days that people have a lot of nausea and vomiting and diarrhea. It's very well tolerated. However, it has some effect on the kidney, especially in people who have low body weight, such as uh, women who are small. So in this case, uh, we, what we can do is uh, monitor or follow a blood test, urine test, to make sure that a patient does not have kidney problems. And in most, in the majority of people, this can be taken without any problems. The second drug, 3TC or FTC, is a very safe drug, and there's hardly any uh, side effects from, from this drug. Now, the third drug, efavirenz, is a drug that crosses into the brain, which is good in terms of lowering the virus in the brain. However, because of that, it has some toxicity, some side effects, such as dizziness, sometimes uh, uh, problems with attention, this occurs mostly during the first few weeks of uh, taking efavirenz. That's why we say to take efavirenz and the whole regimen at night before bedtime. This usually goes away with time, but however, in some patients, it's so severe that we have to use a different drug. Now, another drug that is used a lot also is nevirapine. And this can be used in people who can't tolerate to efavirenz because of dizziness or can be used from the very beginning. And this is a drug that has to be taken twice a day. Uh, it is very safe. However, in the first two weeks of taking nevirapine, there is a chance that it could cause rash uh, or cause some uh, problems in the liver. And again, this can be taken safely if we monitor these symptoms. And in patients who have any problems, then we check to make sure they don't have liver problems. And then we can always switch this drug to another drug. So as a whole, I would say that HIV treatment nowadays is very safe. The side effects are usually mild, and many of them go away with time. So if we can you know, follow patients very, very closely, make sure they know side effects to look for, and then I think treatment is generally very, very safe.